Today I have something very different to show you. A product that has been dormant for seven years. Nope, it's not a sound card, but the successor to the Strix Magnus. Doesn't ring a bell, does it? I don't blame you. It really was a long time ago. Anyway, this right here is the ROG Carnix, our next gaming microphone. The design and construction make it so premium. Despite all the tech inside, you can be set up in less than a minute. Take out the Carnix gaming microphone, connect it to your PC or laptop using the 3 meter USB Type A to Type C cable, and you're set. An extra Teflon pad for the hinge is included, and of course the QSG and warranty booklet are in the box, in case you actually read them. The quality feel and design of the Carnix lead you to believe this is professional recording equipment. That's not far from the truth if you dive into all the intricate details. While the bold aesthetics complement other products from the ROG ecosystem, function meets form. Take the familiar triangle element, for example. The weight's incorporated into the hinge screw and the shock mount to not only reflect consistent design language, but also being effective in its function. The cylindrical design also eliminates potential dead corners, which could result in echoes or reflection interference. Capturing your voice using the large 25mm condenser capsule with high res sampling rate and higher bit depth will give you studio grade quality. While the small diaphragm condenser microphones has its advantages in specific scenarios, the large diaphragm ones, like the one in the Orange Conics, are far more versatile. It's able to capture virtually the entire frequency spectrum produces less noise not externally but internally and perhaps most important of all lush and warm vocals this trade is because the pickup pattern is less consistent for those who prefer the frequency response to be less neutral than the small diaphragm counterpart once sound is picked up by the microphone it needs to be converted into digital audio so we need to ensure the sampling rate and bit rate can cater to our needs what we want is wide frequency range and high dynamic range. There's a misconception that higher sampling rate equates to better audio quality. In actual fact, it simply allows you to capture higher frequencies. Sampling rates of 44.1 kHz can reproduce all the frequencies within the human hearing range and slightly more. The Carnix, on the other hand, lives in the high res territory capable of 192 kilohertz. While CDs use 16-bit audio, the ROG Carnix offers 24-bit. The 144 decibel dynamic range is high enough to capture sounds lower than what humans can hear and louder than what we can tolerate. It's safe to say the Carnix can capture every detail possible in high res. What you don't want though is unwanted noise in high def. That's why the Carnix utilizes the cardioid polar pattern design. In other words, it's unidirectional. Cardioid mics lock into your voice, sounds coming from the sides are typically 6 decibels less sensitive, and more than 20 decibels less from the rear. Even when your voice is the isolated source and every detail is picked up, there are still some unwanted noise to filter out. Low frequencies bounce off walls and bend around corners easily, so the integrated high-pass filter cuts out low-frequency background noises below 80 Hz, such as rumbling and humming. If you do have a habit of accentuating your B's and P's when you talk, then the pop filter made of foam and mesh layers will come in handy for reducing plosive sounds, especially when in close proximity to the mic. Let's put it to the test. The Peugeot that is the predecessor to Peugeot 2 is piloted impeccably on the beautiful and spacious Boltius by the Proficient Pro. The metal shock mount with elastic suspension cables holding the ROG Carnix essentially allows the entire microphone to be suspended in midair, 
Any noises from shocks or vibrations in the mount or table surface, sometimes from the cat jumping onto the table, as they often do, are dampened by the elastic suspenders. There are times where you do need to touch the microphone to mute, for example. There's a touch sensor at the top of the microphone. This avoids having to press a physical button, which ends up being in the recording. A red LED on top, as well as the aura effect, let you know when the mic is muted. Another simple tap makes it glow green, which indicates that the mic is back on. The sensor doubles as a mode switch for the aura lighting effects. Just hold for two seconds to enable or disable. As part of the minimalistic design, the single multi-function control knob can be used to adjust the volume of the mic and monitoring headset, as well as the high pass filter. Press on the knob to toggle between the mic and headset volume modes. The white LED indicates the mode that is currently adjustable. The adjustments for each are completely independent. Hold the knob for two seconds to enable or disable the high pass filter. On the rear, you can find the USB port for data connection and a 3.5 mm jack for your monitoring headset. The connected headset offers side tone so you can monitor the balance in real time. The worst thing that could happen is to finish your recording, then find out the voice volume was set too high or low compared to the game content. The bundled 3 meter cable was made long enough to reach desktop PCs placed on the ground, or if you need to use the Carnix as a boom mic. Under the metal shock mount, you find a mounting point for a 3 8 inch mount screw, compatible with most third party stands and boom arms. For those who need this versatility, the extra Teflon washer included may come in handy. All the intuitive physical controls and more can be found in Armored Crate. Some microphone input settings you might want to try are Noise Gate, which minimizes background noise by cutting out anything with volume below the thresholds you define, while Perfect Voice ensures the volume of your recordings remains consistent and never deviates more than the thresholds you define. Side tone is the main reason to hook up a monitoring headset, but you don't have to hear the microphone input if you need to focus on other content such as games. What's more are the lighting controls. You may personalize the lighting to reflect your channel or brand, sync with the rest of your ROG gear or use one of the preset modes, static, breathing, color cycle, music, rainbow or strobing. The lighting and design of the Carnix are unmistakably ROG. The distinctive gamer's aesthetics makes this microphone a perfect match for the rest of your gaming gear and accessories, which is an important consideration if you are streaming in front of camera. You could let your skills speak for itself, sure, but expressing your own style makes a lasting impression. For best audio recordings, the microphone needs to be in proximity. You can't escape it. So why not get one that's created for gamers? Whether you're looking to mount it on an arm or decorate the desk, the Carnix is perfect in either scenario. To communicate with your teammates and audience clearly, 24-bit 192kHz recordings will provide the clarity you'd expect from a professional microphone. The way you sound via the large 25mm condenser capsule is rich and warm, while unwanted noise and plosive sounds are kept to a minimum with the aid from the cardioid polar pen design. A pop filter, high pass filter, metal shock mount with elastic suspension cables, and additional software tweaks such as perfect voice and noise gate. The Carnix gives you complete control over the microphone and the balance of the volume in contrast to the audio in games. Once you're all set, it's as easy as a tap to go live. <laughs>